Hello. Hi, everybody. It's dark out. <laughs> we skipped doing uh, morning videos today because what the heck happened here? Chickens happened. They knocked over our Rubbermaid container. There's probably an egg in it, too. Anyways, we skipped doing... Um, We skipped doing morning chores because there was nothing exciting happening this morning. And there's most likely not going to be anything exciting happening this evening either. What happened to the, what happened to, it's like a pig out or something? Yeah. There's never anything exciting happening until there is. <laughs> that's that's like the only way I can describe farming. Put this hay back in there so they have something in that room. All right. So, anyways, yeah, nothing exciting happened this morning. It was kind of a a quick morning chores routine because it was rainy and gross, and I thought I was gonna go up to the house and clean out our basement, which is my leather workshop. But that didn't work out because we ended up going shopping. We needed to go to the grocery store. Yeah, green egg ever. Got a good, good, pretty this green egg. This one, it's normal. The normal green egg. egg. Okay. Ooh, yeah. Hold them up together so you can see the difference. Can you see one? This one's like bluish, and it has. I don't know if you'd be able to see. Maybe. Hold on. Can it focus? Huh? It has white. Let me take my glove off. It has. That's all right. It's good. It has white speckles real pretty yeah it's a beautiful egg it's like tiffany blue so we've been leaving the horses in because well we did put them out yesterday i guess but um it's really just pointless to put them out right now they're gonna tear everything up and this light behind me is the bane of my existence they're just gonna tear everything up and there's just really no point in it so we're just leaving them in uh the cows have been good actually our hay ring was intact this morning and they were quite happy because I gave them a salt block. So that worked out and it's been working out too that we don't have to run them water because the um, natural spring there is doing a wonderful job of providing them with fresh, clean water. So everything is working out pretty good. Uh, there was just nothing to report to you guys this morning. So it's kind of like the way we like it, but I know it's not entertaining for YouTube. That being said, I'm probably just gonna put you guys on a time lapse so that we can get our chores done. I have um, bread to make when I get up to the house. Yes, Jade. I have uh, bread to make when I get up to the house because I do. I, I did a bread club. So it, it covered four holidays, Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's, and Easter. And so I make two big loaves and rolls. So tomorrow I'm gonna do um, buttermilk rolls i'm know. buttermilk rolls i'm going to do breadsticks instead of a loaf and i'm gonna make new year's pretzels for good luck so i gotta get all of this done so i can get up there and get the bread going so i'm gonna put you guys on a time lapse and we're gonna get these barn chores done Stalls are clean. Uh, everybody's got hay. Everybody's doing good. Look at the goaties. Oh 
my gosh, how much hay did you give these guys? Um, so, <clears throat> I had... Hi, Bridget. I have a... Um, I have a kind of New Year's tradition of cleaning pig pens. So, I'll be doing that probably New Year's Day. And if it's frozen enough, which I don't think it's going to be because everything's just disgustingly muddy, I think I might um, come in here with the skid steer, move these girls out of here, and clean out their bedding pack so that they have a fresh start, uh, which will be nice. But it's just... Yes, did you, you didn't capture what she was on last night, did you? No, uh, just a picture. I gotta move. I had this crate back here in the corner for when we were uh, weaning Solstice, and I never moved it out of there. And um, Miss Bridget was standing on top of the wire crate. <laughs> she's ah, she's such a goober. Uh, I just I just love this little goat though. She's just she's, she's a ham. Girl. Yeah, she's a sweet goat. I do. Yeah, say hi to the people. She's a sweet sweet girl. So. We're gonna bring a registered Nigerian dwarf buck in. From what I understand, he's registered and we're not sure if he had been shown, but his offspring- he, he, He's a chunk. Yeah, his offspring have actually gone on to, <laughs> can't eat the camera. His offspring have actually gone on to win a lot of things, I guess. Uh, we're going to breed him to Miss Bridget here and Solstice, her daughter. And then whatever we have, whether we have a buckling or if we have doelings, especially doelings, fingers crossed, we'll be able to, hi Danny, we'll be able to keep because that will be an outcross for us, which will be really nice. And from what I understand, he, he is, he's basically the same color as Bridget, maybe a little bit lighter, well, we know but that. he throws a lot of color i guess so we could have lots of cool colors huh yeah, yeah. Maybe well tell me about it black this time. i mean black's pretty i though, like black we I always like get black. brown I know. i'm hoping for some unique colors like can we get I, black I would and like white? i would like a chamose yeah <laughs> we like different colored goats and here's miss freya huh freya hi She's going to be having her baby she's, soon, too. She's really happy Here's Miss right Solstice. Now. She's really happy right now because she ate her first treat ever. Mm -hmm. She won't take treats from me, so she finally ate one. Yeah. Nice. Loki. So I still, Loki is finally getting along with Freya, which is like a huge accomplishment. And she used, to, she used to beat him up. Now they're getting along, although she'll still, that's cinch with his heaves coughing. Anyways, she'll still kick Loki out once in a while, but they, they cuddle. How are you getting under there? That's good, James. <laughs> yeah, she, she they still get it. along. She sleeps under it. Yeah. But uh, I think we're probably still going to get rid of Loki. We're probably going to find him a good pet home as a, as a weather because he just has zero buck tendencies. Isn't that right? Isn't that right? Yeah. Okay. And he should by now. So he just doesn't have a lot of drive. And if we're, again, our goal is to breed really great quality homestead goats. The, the breed isn't necessarily important to us, but the quality and the demeanor and the Tanny. viability of breeding is very important to us in our program. So when you have a buck that isn't doing buck things, in my opinion, he should be castrated and kept as a pet. Some people would call him completely i won't do that i think he's got a great demeanor and will make somebody a great pet but that being said he's just not something i find to be of breeding quality what so he just isn't gonna fit in with our program unfortunately right. but at least we were able to save him and give him a really good home because the alternative was he was gonna end up probably going to the meat man <laughs> so at, at least we we saved him from that huh? hi doll bridgie Look at what Jade's doing. I will say this, we got very lucky hey. with Danny. Look what Jade's doing. Look at these kisses. Gold kisses. Look what Jade's doing. Coast. Gold kisses. That's nice. I see. She's trying to get on your lap. You're not supposed to have favorites. Okay. Let's go, Jade. You're not supposed to have favorites. Jade! Jade! But this is my, this is my girl here. Um, Jade! Only chicken do this. I spent the time milk training her and 
I milked her because she has smaller teeth, so it wasn't fun for Miss Harley to milk. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't really that. It was, it was fine if I could get her to let down. Yeah, but me and her bonded. So, that's my girl. I milked Danny. I'm really, really, really excited to see what she throws with that buck. It'll probably be exactly that color. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> probably exactly. Okay. Anyways, this is how nights are spent down here. You know, we, we do our barn work and then we can kind of just chill with the animals. And that's the favorite part of having them. You know, you get to just hang out with them and love on them. I'm going to milk her over there. Miss Freya? Yeah. I'm going to have hey. Chase help me with hey. that. Look, look what Jade's doing. I see what Jade's doing. She's totally on you. She's cold and she wants to go to the house. Let's take her up. Like a Caleb's going to come down here and park that quad anyways, right where you're at. Help. Come on, Jade. Come on, Jade. Come on, let's go. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I guess that's going to wrap it up for today. Okay, kind of a short video. Kind of a short video. Oh, yeah. Good. Say hi. Chase has a fan club, so, you know, it, it's a rare cameo when he... Yeah shows up yeah 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 right. that's okay it is a, we got dirt hold on there I wonder go. why so anyways that's about gonna wrap it up for tonight we're gonna head up and i got a lot of bread to bake so i will catch you guys again tomorrow we'll see you guys in the next one bye, bye. bye.